Welcome to this game character course. Now during this course we're going to be creating this little chap here, this little minion, and we're going to create a low res game version of this character and we're going to take it in to Substance Painter and then export the textures maps out with the mesh and finally take it into Marmoset. So along the way we'll be creating a high poly character like this guy here and then we'll I'll be showing you how we can retopologize it to get a low poly version of it. So to show you the low poly version of this, I'm just going to go into this and click this off and this is our low poly. So we'll be ending up taking this into Substance Painter and then baking our high poly detail straight in to it inside of Substance Painter. Now I'm going to be showing you a method of exporting this character straight out of ZBrush and putting it straight into Substance Painter without using any other tools. Now if you're using Maya or 3D Max or any of the other programs you can of course use those methods to play around with the F FBX imports or exports or the OBJ exports that we do as well. So I'll be having a look and giving you a fully detailed um, description of exactly what is going on when we do our exports and uh, why things are happening inside of Substance Painter. So you have a full understanding of how the maps get generated. We'll also be looking at not um, making sure we do mesh names so that our normal maps are projected correctly and don't cause any artifacts artifacts on any other part of the mesh. So it's really involved this course. Um, it's a primer, so I've tried to keep it as simple as possible. It's a primer to my game character course workshops that are going to be coming out throughout 2018. So if you're into this and you're new to it, or you're intermediate and you want to get into game characters then this is a great starter course and it will prepare you for the much more involved workshops that we're going to work through throughout 2018. So I hope you enjoy this course and um, yep I'll see you in there. Uh, I'll just show you the final image that we're going to be uh, producing out and here is this guy here that we have actually used the Marmoset viewer to output so you can see that um, even though it's a low poly version you can see these slight lines going around you've still got um, it's still pretty clean and this could be used for a game you could be taken straight into a game engine and obviously you could take it into uh, another program and produce your FBX uh, animation sequences, your run cycles, etc. Walk cycles, picking things up, and you can export those out and then bring those into Unity or UDK. So, like I said, my workshops can be working through bringing us right to um, the games engines where I'll be producing a level for you and taking a main character into that level as well, and maybe having him sort of run around and stuff. So, we've got all that to look forward to, but in the meantime, take this course have a look and uh, understand what we're trying to do in this course so if we look now you can see all the different maps that have been produced from this guy um, and the topology as well okay so without further ado I'm going to get stuck into the course if you want to join me then sign up